Welcome back to the Professionally Hot podcast. Welcome back. We have a special guest tonight, Miss Ash Gray, Hello. here with Hello. us. It is Ashley T. and Kenzie. Hi, it's Ashley T. This is our second episode, and we have some some weird shit to talk about tonight. There's some really, really weird shit to talk about tonight. We asked people on Twitter and Instagram to send us the weirdest... We asked cam girls and content creators to send us the weirdest stuff that they have been asked to do for videos and content. We thought we would share it with you guys. So I thought we would start off by sharing our own weird things that we've been asked to do. Oh yeah. And Ashley, there would you some, like to oh, God. start off a few of yours? You know, okay. I, I've talked about this one so many times and I'm gonna bring it up again. Um, it just It just takes the cake without there being cake involved. It just, on more than one occasion, which is fucking wild to me that this is so specific and yet still so broad as to have been asked more than one time, um, I have been requested to set up my camera in such a way that the, the, the camera is angled at, at a keyboard, at my keyboard, because an individual willing to pay for said content wants to pretend that they are a teeny tiny itty bitty so little man small. so small tiny itty bitty man mm. and they would like to pretend that they are running in between the keyboards <laughs> and as i am typing they run the risk of mortality <laughs> and they're like oh no don't cr- crush me with your fingers as you type so fast you giant woman but i might absolutely die crush them and i'm like sir Sir, when, when... How did this start? When did this... What made you want this? At one point in time, were you listening to someone type and you were like... Mm, I want to be in between those keys. I want to be in between those keys and also, I'm horny. <laughs> like, what the fuck? By the way, this is the kink shaming episode. Welcome back to episode two called Kink Shaming. Yeah, so sorry Ash, if you have... Ashley and Kenzie. <laughs> if you have any of these fetishes, we think you're fucking weird. Also, if your fetish is being kink shamed, enjoy. Mm-hmm. You owe yes, us all for you. so much money. All of our <laughs> money receptacle <laughs> options are linked somewhere. We will, be, we will be shamelessly self-promoing at the end. This is a self-promo. Ash, would you like to give some of your weird <gasps> things you've been asked to do? It's kind of like, where do you even start? Like, there's the basic ones that all of us in the industry know. We have Dial Steve. Mm -hmm. Dial Steve. Yes, the man with the soap. Who really just wants to watch... Honestly, he really just wants to watch a bar of Dial Soap. Yeah. You are just kind of an extra. Did he want us to eat it or... I've seen... A couple girls say that he wanted them to look. I remember it. him being For like, me, "Can you put he in your wanted mouth? me to like really just focus on a specific area and not like insert it, but like okay. pull oh it with it there." That would be horrible. Okay. Was the request that I got? Okay. <laughs> but Steve, what the fuck? I feel like that has to start from getting your mouth washed out with soap when you're a child. Right? Like everything's from childhood. You know what I mean? Like, right. That's gotta so be it's gotta some be, Freudian yeah, thing. Yeah, a hundred percent. Yeah, yeah, no, definitely. No, definitely. And then there's the cheese guy. Mm-hmm. The cheese guy. Craft singles, man. Craft, Craft singles, singles so guy. Sexy. See, with these these like ones that get so specific with it, where it's like specifically dial soap, it's like specifically craft singles. It makes me really wonder if they're just actually like in charge of these things all the time, and mm-hmm. they were trying to like reclaim them, like from. Ha- like, how the fuck you open your fridge one day and be like, oh, yeah, <laughs> Those on some titties, sign me up. I want to see that shit all over your forehead. <laughs> like, there's got to be something about happens. <laughs> I never got, you know what, I feel left out. Like, 10 years in the industry, Dial Steve never made his way no. to me. What? I know, I never got to meet the it's legend himself. Steve, where are you at? Yeah. Steve, if you're like, listening, we miss you. <laughs> yeah. I love you. Yeah. There's been there's been quite a few of the cam girls having the same guy coming into all their rooms Steve. and asking, yeah, Steve, Steve and the craft single guys, yeah. Does craft single guy have a name? No, I, it's just, I always just call him the cheese guy, the cheese, guy. cheese slice the cheese guy. guy. Cheese I think he, it might have actually been craft single. Yeah, I think so too. He had me put cheese on my forehead. Yeah. <laughs> so I never, I don't <laughs> like craft, mine, so mine I wouldn't have that. had that in my fridge. Mine was that he wanted. I was with another girl. Oh. 
And he wanted her to, like, throw them at my body. Because <laughs> they would stick. Because yeah, so, they would stick. Like the sticky hands. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it was like so a sticky funny. hand, but crab cheese. But, like, cheese? <laughs> yeah. Cheese? Like, yeah. how do you how do you end up, like, cheese? I could make a grilled cheese with this, or I could furiously <laughs> masturbate instead. Like, what the fuck? Has oh, there any, been God. anything that's been specific to you? Specific to me, honestly, these days I weed out requests. Mm, that's totally But if you go fair. back to the beginning, I feel like there was a guy that really wanted me to snort pepper. Oh, oh. no. That was, and like, that, that was, sucks. Yeah. And it's like also one of those ones where it's like, why? I, I mean, because there's sneezes, there's yeah. the little sneeze boys. Right. Yeah, the sneeze. And that's fine. Fish. But, like, this one, like, specifically, and I was, like, brand new, and I didn't do it. Yeah, I was going to say, like, did you do it? But, uh, yeah, they, like, specifically, he was like, can you, like, do you have a pepper grinder? And I was <laughs> yeah, like... Yeah, you want to grind was, that pepper for me, girl? <laughs> right, I was like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yes. unfortunately. Like, would you be open to something a little bit different? <laughs> and I was um. like, no. But, like, that's the only time that I've had someone actually asked me to snort uh, seasoning <laughs> for them. <laughs> we love a s- snorting seasoning moment. Armpit liquors? You guys get armpit I liquors? I do get armpit, armpit liquors. But honestly, yeah. I feel like that's pretty common. Yeah. It is. You know, but like to the average listener out there, it might not be so co- Armpit liquors are the very ones common. we've received today, it's really not that uh, It's pretty vanilla. Intense. It's so hard yeah. to take your bias out of it because like I forget that like we've been in the industry for you know a decade a decade yeah, yeah all of us point, are 10 and, years like, i see the i see all these things and i'm like okay yeah it's like a little weird but mm-hmm. whatever you know yeah. but like you know Once you've seen random it all. jane that works in tech is gonna be like what the actual <laughs> fuck are yeah. you talking you're about like jane it's no problem you just gotta wash the deodorant <laughs> off first because that yeah. shit tastes like ass yeah. and then Can you imagine all the go. babies coming in right now all the 18 year olds and people are asking them like to do the weird shit and they're like what? What? Like, what do you mean? No one's ever heard of this. Girl, we've heard of it. We yeah, have. we've heard you, of it. You've heard it here first. Be you surprised have. at literally nothing. No. Yeah. Mine is um, the... I had, a, I had a man come into my room a few months ago, and he had a o- very obvious fetish for America's Funniest Home Videos. <laughs> 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 like, started off very simple questions, like, do you... Have you ever seen this show? Would you ever want to be on it? And... Just by like the third, actually by the first question, I was like, "You have a fetish for America's mm-hmm. Homes videos," and he tried to deny it at first. But as it went on, he's like, "No, no, no, I just kind of like it." And I, you know, it's either that he was he liked the idea of being embarrassed, which is very normal. Yeah. But I also think that it was more like he saw a hot girl on it that was embarrassing other men, or that like there was he like actually put in a video for it and that the whole and world was, was literally wa- like laughing at him because that shit was really popular and honestly my question to him was is that show still on <laughs> like, i was like what do you mean i was like Amer- no i have Wait, not but watched is it, it still on i think, I think so, so but like just not for that the, one guy yeah. that it's just him submitting <laughs> yeah, videos he's now. the he's the only reason it's staying alive yeah. it's just one dude fucking jerking it <laughs> <laughs> um we received a lot um so we we're did. just kind of rapid fire going through these um Ashley, would you like to start us off and we can kind of just go yeah, around? And I, I will just say honorable mention to Craft Singles Guy and Dial Steve. Y'all have been mentioned like 400 times. Yeah. So if you're listening, which you probably are, congratulations. Yeah. You have reached legend status <laughs> and I hope you've received all the cheese and soap your boners could possibly desire. Um, love this one. A guy asked me to dissect a frog in my fanciest lingerie. Did not do it. What is a seventh grade science class? Like what the fucking. Goodness. That's got to so be. Much. That's, that's where that comes from. Yeah. Someone asked for a custom where I turned them into a turkey, <laughs> cooked them in the oven, and then ate them from their POV. Oh. I'm honestly sad I didn't do it. It was when I first started. I feel like I could have had so much fun with that idea. You have to have such a good imagination to do those kind of things because, like, it's hard enough to already make content 
in like you know normal general like joys or whatever kind yeah. of thing but to be like okay you're a little turkey now <laughs> like also, what like what are you stuff, supposed to say doing stuff like that is so hard also, yeah don't you know how bitch it is to cook a turkey <laughs> that shit takes forever yeah. like are that's we talking like a well cooked turkey, turkey right yeah I, I, I mean i need the cost of the turkey and the labor of going through <laughs> yeah. and cooking a goddamn turkey. i don't even know how to cook a turkey so i need instructions <laughs> yeah i need to look up a recipe yeah, yeah that's a that's a yeah. hefty fee yeah okay you guys are gonna love this one because i'm literally laughing my ass off I had someone ask me to take my hair extensions and clip them to the thong <laughs> and pretend I had really long butthole hair. <laughs> oh now that's original. That's, such that's a good original. One. That's where like, did these start though? Like what where, moment in their lives are they like, that's fucking Like, did you see a butthole hair for the first time and you were like, <laughs> it I needs want to be longer. <laughs> so many more of those. <laughs> that is so oh good. Oh my God. Um, some of these are just like straight up scary. Stuff. Read the scary ones. Okay. We need then we need them. After seeing snaps of me in the bath, okay. Normal, sexy, no, no, no. good times. This individual wanted a custom video of her holding her breath for as long as possible underwater, <laughs> staying completely still with her eyes open. Oh my gosh, it's the eyes open here. That's, that's not like, right. No, that that's is some gosh. that that's, is some uh, scary stuff. And also is. hard to do. My eyes would be fucking I'm burning. Gonna right. have nightmares yeah yeah not down um working out to get sweaty and when i'm sweaty enough to rub nutella all over my oh. body and stick a peeled banana to my pussy um <coughs> what, what the, the fart fuck? you know the first part is like okay there's lots of workout guys out yeah. there there's lots oh, yeah. of like no, i want your sweat that's sure. like super normal yeah. but the nutella is an interesting that's a mm-hmm. it took a 180 there yeah a that's bit. a whole other thing we also uh, have the ones that are obviously like you know like scat and pee play. There's a lot of poo. Just kind of like a part of the whole thing. I have never, would never. You'd have to pay me a lot of money, and I really don't want to do any of that. Truly, a lot of these also involve cutting hair. I'm. Is this like church, or like are we going back to the biblical <laughs> stories, or like, <laughs> like uh, or cloning? Oh, here we go. Two minute video of my armpit at different angles. You know what, girl? I think we've seen the uh, same guy. Same yeah, guy. the I armpit thing is a lot real. Of armpit guys throughout the years. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The um, armpit ones make sense. It's like I can understand it them being looks like, like a yeah. I think it's the same area as crack. well. I think it's also the same area as like feet. Like yeah. there is it's a place that it's like could spot. possibly be fucked or kind whatever. Of, I mean, like it makes me look at deodorant ads in a whole other way. Oh True yeah, that. somebody's getting off for free uh, somewhere. Yeah. Maybe not the weirdest, but one of my favorite custom orders was werewolf transformation role play. No effects, no special effects, just me going, wow, I got so hairy. I'm so itchy. Look at my pointy ears. And at the end, I howl and scamper away on all fours. Ah, <laughs> Yo, I would do that one. Yeah, I'd do oh, that 100%. shit for like $10. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like it would just be fun to do. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, some of them do, like, turn out just to be fun to do. Yeah. Even yeah. though they're kind of ridiculous and far-fetched, mm-hmm. like, it's so silly that it goes full circle. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it's just kind of, it's, it's part of the job. <laughs> asked me if I'd masturbate with a ham and cheese sandwich. Got offended uh, when I asked if he'd provide additional funds for the ingredients. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I Come mean. on, man. I gotta get the ham also, and cheese Also, how do you somewhere. masturbate with the ham and cheese sandwich i feel like that'd be very like unstable you know like also you've not, very, it's just a weird mm. that, mm. is there mayo in it like <laughs> <laughs> do we have something to hold it together this what kind of bread sweet. i need to know like details this is so upsetting honey baked ham is it gonna fall <laughs> apart? oh gross <laughs> yeah uh I had a dude who was sexually attracted to the act of going through a car wash. I had to describe the brushes and all of the suds, getting on the tracks and going into neutral. It was specific to drive through car washes. I'd never encountered that before, but it was fun. Honestly, I kind of get it. I yeah. fucking, I mean, like, I love a car wash. Like, not it doesn't, like yeah. it does, not like that, but like a car wash is so good. I wanted them to my brain. Like, yeah. I just want a good car wash through my through little my smooth brain. brain. Yeah. Yeah. What yeah. else we got? Um, let's see. Sneeze content. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, sn- yes. Yeah, sneezing is definitely a big one too. Belly buttons, like 
you know, Probably all those kind of things. I feel like things. lunar is too. What the fuck? I would like to see if you are interested in making a custom video for me. The idea is, I have these two custom-made chrome metal bowling balls. You wake up one morning after drinking to find both your big toes stuck in the metal balls. If you are interested in making the video, let me know and we can talk price and the whole script. Signed, Ray. <laughs> Thank you, Ray. <laughs> Thanks, Ray. Thanks for um, I sent a bunch to the our, mess, our group chat. Oh, good. Oh, nice. I want to read Sasha's shout out to Sasha for providing the most asinine shit. Yeah, I will read these ones. Mm -hmm. These ones are the ones I got on Instagram. Please do. So we have, um, we've got put a goldfish up my ass and squeeze it out, Uh and they said yes, an actual goldfish, not a cracker. I asked, um, (laughs) just a a slight animal abuse, no big deal. Um, I was asked to walk around wearing only black knee-high rain boots and a puffer jacket. The puffer jackets is a big one, oh, too. Oh, puffy jackets. jackets. There are these guys that really like puff women's puffy jackets, and they want to fuck the sleeves. And I think that the best place to get those is probably Goodwill. Like, if you are into that, just go to Goodwill. Go to Goodwill. And, there's yeah. always a ton of them. Yeah. Um, eat talkies until my tongue was red and act like we were sharing. Hold the bag up and offer some. That's kind of cute. That's, that's, that's actually kind of yeah. He just wants to he just wants to share. He wants to share another talkies. armpit one, but to grow the hair out, shave it, and mail it. Um, they did make two hundred dollars off of it though, so that's pretty right, impressive. Nice. It's not bad. Throwing singles, catching with your tits. Like there's very like things many many that are just like yeah, I yeah. could do that. You know. Yeah. We have the balloon popping people yeah. and the and the super common pool toy the pool toys Su- and they're loud about it mm-hmm. they're loud yeah. about it but the the uh, the people that I've encountered in that community have always been very respectful they are very respectful which is really nice mm-hmm. they are and if you laugh at them a little bit they're willing to laugh yeah, at themselves they it's are. quite quite wholesome actually yeah. cheers to the balloon people y'all are actually good people yeah yeah. This one comes from Miss Cleo Blossom. Mm-hmm. Shout out to Cleo. Clap okay. my thighs together fully clothed while pretending to read the dictionary. <laughs> Count how many bites it took to eat half a burrito. Oh. One. That's so specific. Yeah, yeah, just one all the way down. Here are Sasha's. Um, tell someone with a feeding fetish they're overweight while she laughs at, at them and drinks Diet Coke because, in their words, Diet Coke is only for skinny people. Oh, <gasps> God. Very Tumblr 2012 vibes. Yes. We love that. That's yeah, painful. Shove my face in a strawberry cake and moan while eating cinnamon swirls in a muffin. Mm. This is my favorite one from her. Pretend I am in World War II and an air raid shelter and put air raid shelter sounds on. Hide under her bed sheets and scream until someone tips to turn it off. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Sasha, what the fuck? Um, the soup one is my favorite one actually because I I have seen the video. She had someone that um wanted her to cover herself in carrot and coriander soup and yogurt, and uh, she her camera did not work, so she had to do it again. <laughs> And oh, now, no. now she can't eat any of those yeah. things because... Yeah, no. And the video is absolutely repulsive. Like, I can understand why she wouldn't want to eat that. She still looks hot because she's very hot. But, like, Even covered in face soup, covered in, like, yeah. orange soup. And then she had to do... Uh, she had to snort a chow mein noodle to see if it would go down her throat. And then no! she had to sh- throw it on the cam. No! <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, the craft singles... Take a shit. Um, lots of poop. Yeah, lots, lots of, poop. of poop. Lots of poop. Yes, yeah. Man. Lots of poop. Yeah. Lots uh, of pee. Just eat. body expression. This one says, uh, sit on a pile of snails while wearing jeans. Aww, <laughs> snails. I know. Uh, eat an entire Wendy's, Wendy's four and four for four with her tits out. That's a lot of hamburger. Yeah. yeah um, like I fuck with Wendy's, but that's a lot. It is a lot. Uh, this one comes from Violet Rain. She said that she was asked in a PM if she had a butt plug and hot sauce. She said yes, but realized why the two would be grouped together. <laughs> <laughs> 12 hours minimum soaking in hot sauce before what? she could put it in her butt. <laughs> so sadistic. So sadistic. Um, someone said to skateboard down a gauntlet of people throwing eggs. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, that sounds kind of fun. Oh, my God. Um, the hypnotizing one for you. Um, oh, yeah. see, now yeah. that one gave me the heebie-jeebies, though. Yeah. That actually freaked me out. Any of the ones where they're, like, like a few people, but, like, 
oh, someone wanted a custom of me, like, pretending to be a mannequin. <laughs> that one of, like, laying underwater with my eyes yeah. open, pretending to be hypnotized. I'm like, this is giving me the spooky. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Not not a fun vibe. Also, no. um, giving, a, a like, two girls, one giving the other one a wedgie with jeans on until your jeans rip through your ass. See? Literally the worst thing I could think about. I would that's probably also- do all the other ones, but, like, my, your poor butthole. Like, that's not fair. That's Ow. not cool. Also, no. it just, like, wouldn't work. Yeah, no. No, At you'd all. have to have, you'd have like... You'd have to, like, pre-distress yeah, already, the denim. Yeah. 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 And then we're looking at the cost of jeans and mm-hmm. the cost of my ass being on fire. <laughs> right? yeah. Even your hands, like having yeah, to pull like, on that would be a would lot. I know. Uh, and then there's um, one that I knew from an old friend that was, um, she had to uh, faint and then oh, stand no. up and then faint again. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> and that one was, uh, I think that she did it. I'm pretty sure she did. But watching her reenact it was top tier comedy would uh would understand doing it i think she got paid like a thousand dollars too so that's awesome. worth it to some just... lovely individual said been in this 10 years the options are endless and like mm-hmm. relatable he wanted me to watch the movie the river wild with meryl streep but only the scene where the protagonist kills the antagonist oh. and he dramatically sullenly fro- floats down the river mm-hmm. he wanted me to react to it like dramatically like it was a really big deal while stripping in quotations <laughs> oh my question gosh. question 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 <laughs> that amount of multitasking yeah the ones that are like do this and then this and then this it's like okay you're oh, really yeah. adding up the dollar amounts right now dude because i no. really i can't i have adhd i can't I remember know, right? all those things no yeah what else we got fart in a glass yeah, <laughs> yeah. nose picking mm. nose picking um, is a big one too my weirdest one was I had to cover my face in shaving cream and smoke a bunch of cigarettes back to back hands free <laughs> and act like it was some challenge and how easy it was. Yes, I was terrified of setting my face on fire, but I just put a down payment on a house and I was broke. Oh, fuck. Honestly, I, fair. get your yeah, house payment, totally girl. Fair. No, it's so true. I just got one recently actually that I have to, I literally have to make eventually, but like he wants me to play, I think, Uno uh-huh. and. Like, it's like a strip uno thing, Mm -hmm. I guess. And, like, I'm losing, basically. (laughs) And I'm like, great. Like, thank you very much. I'm excited to make it. But at the same time, I'm like, I have to go buy uno cards. (laughs) Someone says, filming a custom request tonight from a Scottish guy who wants me to talk about how hot it is to think about Scottish dudes going commando under their kilts. Oh. oh we got a little cultural flair here yeah. in the customs nice. category. <laughs> that's, a, nice. that's a good one. I do like a man in a kilt. Yeah, I could get behind it. Yeah. <laughs> myself, Underneath it. Oh my God. Myself turning blue and exploding like that girl in Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. <laughs> oh, no. I just send pics of me with a blue filter and he'd sp- spend like $80 a pic. Oh, Violet, you're turning violet. Oh, oh no. my God. That was pretty funny, honestly. Uh, there was once when I was doing a, like a st- straight up show, I think at the moment, and instead of doing just a normal like, oh, okay, we reached the goal, we're gonna have our moment and get off. Uh, they decided they wanted me to do the. Do y'all remember hysterical literature? Yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, do that, but instead of it being some sort of good book, it was. Uh, taken by the T Rex, <laughs> 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 and so they would like stop and start it, and I would have to keep going <laughs> with like full power, full <laughs> throttle, while I'm like, oh, his little arms. <laughs> <laughs> So funny. <laughs> so bad. Also, we have a small chime in from a vanilla man. This thread is bonkers. Am I the only one that just wants to fuck sluts? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is just proof that you are not. You are not the only one that just wants to fuck sluts. What else? It's not close to weirdest, but a guy paid me to put peanut butter all over my boobs. And went, wow, that's so degrading. What if it was shit? (laughs) Well, first of all, it's not. Second of all, I love peanut butter. I'm 100% going to scrape it off my boobs with a spoon and put it on toast after I block you. Yeah, no need to waste. Come on, man. No wasties foodies. We're eating that peanut butter after. No wasties foodies. 
The Fred Flintstone feet man or hiccup man. Love you both, though. Very well. The Fred, like, what? You're just, like, running in no car? Oh, my God. <laughs> when I was doing customs a lot, I got a request to make a video where sentient fruits were scared of me eating them. <laughs> like, make them roll away and give them little voices like, Oh, no, please, don't eat me, ma'am. I have a family. I did not do the vid. But I think about it a lot. <laughs> I would have totally done that video. Yeah. That is hilarious. Oh, that is hilarious. Yeah, finger fucking belly buttons yep. is uh, a real I First year as a cam girl, a guy asked me to finger fuck my belly button while crying. Mm-hmm. Then came oh, back no. for more while because crying. he said it was so fucking good. <laughs> this still tops all the other wild requests. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, that is so good. Getting sprayed with ketchup, hot sauce, and mustard out of squirt guns while doing yoga. That's a oh. lot. Like oh, the first, the first bit is like, okay, I can understand the goo. We all gl- gr- we yeah. grew up in the two thousands, yeah. right? Yeah. We understand yeah, the like the, slime yeah. of the early two thousands. So like, I get the, but like while doing yoga, yeah, that's a that's a lot. But how do we get so complicated so fat? How do we combine those? Yeah, well, two if you're doing things? downward doggy and it's just squirted into you, yeah, that's not okay. Like that's I enjoy a that. Wendy's four stack, but not at the same time <laughs> that I'm trying to get off. You know, how do we combine these two things so fast? No, that is that is unfortunate. Was the last of our thread? I think you know what there were some scary ones. the The moral of the story is y'all are fucking weird. Yeah, um, we love it. Can you look at my Twitter actually? Yes, someone I responded to mine, can. and I don't know what they said because I'm I using can. mine. Yeah, there's a there's quite a lot, and I really would like I want to know the psychology behind it, like especially like the like jacket fucker. Like, did you just see a hot woman wearing a puffy jacket one day, and you were like, "I've got a boner." I think there's also something to be said about like like so many things can turn us on and make us feel a certain type of way. And I think when you're younger, if that becomes your whole entire identity for what turns you on, it can really fuck up sex for you. Like, yeah. it can make it so it's Dude, the only suck. thing. Yeah, and it can make it so it's the only thing that you get turned on by. And it's just not fun. Like, no. you want to be able to have a range of it. And you can also just be like, like I mean, today, even in these days, we'll see something and I'll be like, hmm, new kink unlocked. But yeah. it's like, I don't need it to be my entire life. I'm just like, that's strange and... I guess that's a new thing that I enjoy, but I'm also not gonna like go out of my way to do it. Like I like to watch male gay porn, but I don't wanna. I don't wanna be <laughs> with yeah. them. Yeah, <laughs> no, I completely yeah, yeah. understand that. Yeah, he wanted me absolutely covered in sticky and messy foods, not just sweets, but savory food as well, all mixed. I had to stop filming because I get horrid reactions on my skin. Oh no! <laughs> the stepping on, on bugs. bugs is it for me. <laughs> Poor bugs. Poor oh, bugs. Oh man! What does that one say? This one just says, dump five gallons of green slime over my head. Oh, so that I even get that kind much. Of fun. It would be, but where do you get five gallons of green slime? Amazon. Oh. Dude, that's like when I did the Guaranteed. jello wrestling. Mm. And it's so hard to, f- like, you have to cool it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And, like, that's a lot I even of had a, like, I even had, like, a full size, like, big fridge. Yeah. And it was really hard <clears> to, like, sure. make enough jello to actually fill a, like a kiddie pool that we were gonna wrestle that's a in. lot of jello yeah, yeah that is a lot of jello you know i hope you know that this is hard work all right anybody yes. out here thinking we just shake ass and make money you're right but also sometimes we have to squish snails with our butts okay <laughs> yeah that was poppy <laughs> yeah that was <laughs> um <coughs> Thank you for listening to our little second episode. Um, Ashley T and I will be back for another third episode eventually. But uh, Ash, thank you so much for joining us today for this podcast. I'm sure she'll be back as well. Yeah. And if you have a weird fetish, feel free to send it to us just so we can laugh at you. <laughs> yeah. Especially if your fetish is just being laughed at, because we will. The, but you have to pay us, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you... No, you owe us money for this one, actually. Yeah, actually, yeah. you need to all you need to tip us you all probably, just for listening yeah, to this. Um, shameless self promo time. My name is Kenzie, and my Instagram is kenziebaby.x. My OnlyFans is Little Baby L I T T L E B A B Y, and my Twitter is Fatherfucker with a V, not a C, in the fucker part. <laughs> And I'm Ashley T, and you can find me everywhere as Hey Ashley T. Um, and I'm pretty sure my OnlyFans is also Hey Ashley T. Mm-hmm. I think it probably is. Yes. Um, you can find me on Twitch at Ashley T Cozy because sometimes I'm not a whore. <laughs> <laughs> Occasionally. 
And the lady herself. Yes. You can find me on Instagram as Rogue Potato. You can find me on Twitch as X Cherry Potato for fun hangs rather than a sexy hangs. And on OnlyFans, I am Slutty Potato. Oh, it's just a triple potato over here. It's a is. triple potato. It triple potato. Thank you for listening to the Professionally Hot Podcast. Yes. Where we're really sexy and professionally hot. I'm going to wash my body with some dial soap. Oh. And some craft singles, oh, baby. Yeah. Thanks for listening, guys. Ow.